I got my little reindeer ears on and my elf socks so that can only mean one thing today I'm doing a Christmas slash holiday themed video and I'm gonna be showing you guys a bunch of holiday treats that I'm obsessed with they're all super easy and quick to make so if you have a holiday party coming up or if you just want to get all your friends together and make a bunch of fun treats then hopefully this video will help you and give you some ideas so if you guys decide to make any of these treats then I'd love to see pictures so go ahead and send those to me with the hashtag baking with Beth me and the reindeer are twinning Oh, and I'm also doing a little mini giveaway in this video just because I thought it'd be fun. Sorry if my ears are annoying you. So I love burning candles while I'm baking. I don't know why, I just think it's very soothing and they smell really yummy. So I'm actually going to be giving away these two little candle sets that I got from Ulta from Yankee Candle. And also I saw these at Target and I could not resist. I'm also going to be giving away these adorable EOS Lip Balm Holiday Sets. They're like little ornaments. Now to win the Santa Claus one, all you have to do is leave a comment below telling me which one of these treats is your favorite. Give this video a thumbs up and then subscribe to this channel and my second channel which is Bethany's Life. And for the little reindeer set, all you have to do is follow me on Twitter. I will have a link to it below and then tweet hashtag more moda because right now we're trying to unlock the fourth look in my clothing line. So go ahead and do that if you want to win this one. And I'm just going to go ahead and get into it because let's face it, we want to get to the food. Ho ho ho! So this is just an optional step, but before I get started, I'm just putting on my sparkly Christmas apron and getting my oven mitts ready. So for these adorable marshmallow hot chocolate dippers, you're going to need candy cane sticks. You're also going to need some regular sized marshmallows, some marshmallow fluff, and some sugary white sprinkles. Start off by breaking some of your candy cane sticks in half so that they're going to work better with the marshmallows and then we're just going to stab them right into the marshmallow so that they stand up straight like that. Then taking the marshmallow cream, you're going to go ahead and coat each marshmallow with the cream so that you can dip it right into your sugar crystals and it sticks and looks like snow. Next, I found these North Pole stickers at Target and I stuck those on my little candy cane stick so that it looks like the North Pole. You can also just make one yourself out of paper. And then I took some little round candies and I glued those to the top with some marshmallow cream. And voila, we are done. Now to make these adorable sleigh riding teddy bears, you're going to need some mini Snickers, mini candy canes, teddy grams, and some chocolate chips. So you want to start off with melting your chocolate chips in the microwave and while those are heating up you're going to take one mini Snickers and a Teddy Graham and you're going to have to cut them in half, yes, then apply a little bit of the melted chocolate to the bottom of the Teddy Graham and stick them right on top of the Snickers. Then taking two mini candy canes you're going to add a little bit of the melted chocolate to one side and then place the Snickers right on top of that so it creates a little sleigh. And now for my favorite, the reindeer cupcakes. So I'm starting off with just making some plain old chocolate cake mix out of the box. You can make this from scratch, but I just decided to go with the cake box stuff. Next, I'm just taking my cupcake sheet and I'm filling it up with the little, I don't even know what you call these, like the little paper, little paper things. And I'm walking over to the counter and then I'm just going to go ahead and fill my cupcake pan up with the batter so that we can put them in the oven. And once those babies are finished baking, you're going to take them out and they're going to be warm and delicious. For the reindeers, you're going to need pretzels, vanilla wafers, any ball-shaped candy, some candy eyes, and chocolate frosting. So I'm starting off with frosting all of my cold chocolate cupcakes. Next, you're just going to place the pretzels onto the cupcake to make it look like the little antlers. Then we're placing on the eyes, the vanilla wafer, and then it is time for the nose. And I actually dipped some of my red candy into some chocolate so that we could have a brown nose. And you know one of them has to have a red nose for little Rudolph, so I did that. And then you can place them all on a plate, making sure that Rudolph is the shining star. 
And now you have all of your super adorable reindeer cupcakes. And to make these adorable strawberry Santa hats, you're going to need Oreo cookies. I went with the peppermint ones because I'm super festive like that. Strawberries, buttercream frosting, and a piping bag. So I actually made my own buttercream frosting by combining 8 ounces of cream cheese and 1 stick of butter in an electric mixer. Next, I blended in 1 teaspoon of vanilla extract. And then after that, I just slowly poured in 1 cup of powdered sugar. After that, we're going to transfer our homemade buttercream frosting into a piping bag. We're going to take one strawberry and cut off the little stem so it's smooth and flat. Then we're going to pipe a little bit of the frosting on top of the cookie, place the strawberry on top of that, and then top it off with a little ball for the Santa hat. As you can tell, this one is super duper easy, and you can even add little sprinkles or anything to spice it up a little bit, but can I just tell you guys, this is so delicious, I'm just saying. As we go along, we're walking in a winter wonderland. And for the last treat, all you're going to need is some little mini brownies, which I just got at my local grocery store. Some more strawberries, some round candy, and green frosting. So I'm starting off again by cutting off the stem of the strawberry, applying a little bit of frosting to attach it to the brownie. And all I'm doing is basically piping the green frosting to the strawberry and then lightly pulling away to create that cool tree branch effect, I guess you could say. And then I'm just decking it out with all kinds of sprinkles and candy and all that kind of stuff. And if you have a little star, then you can even put a little star on top. And that's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll talk to you later. Bye. We'll conspire as we dream by the fire, babe. Rudolph the red nose reindeer, reindeer. <laughs> Racer! Oh, oh! Blankets, too. How to be warm. How can I sleep when I'm afraid to dream? <laughs> It is day one of shooting for the line and it's going to be a lot of fun so I'm taking you guys along with me and I'll see you there. They, they're going to see us from outer space, outer space, light it up, like we're the stars of the human race, human race. Huh?